Hey aunties, I am being really bad this morning because now I decided, oh, she can't be left in her winter wear and lay next to Kingston. So I want to see what she's going to look like in this purple romper. So I am going to, um, I should have put the flash on so you guys can see her eyes. Um, hmm. Oh well, um, her eyes look so dark on here but anyway but um yeah so she had on this this was a little outfit that came from overseas with one of my babies that I had got um as a girl and I changed it to a boy so this outfit has the matching hat it's been laying in there but Zoe let me see if you guys as you can see, Zoe. Zoe is very soft. She's much softer than um, Kingston. Yeah. Oh, she she's way softer to me. That's just my opinion. Look at that. Um, he's soft. She's still firm enough to where she doesn't lo lose her fur. Her. She doesn't lose her form. And of course, this is my favorite hand with her too. <laughs> I'm such a hand and feet fanatic. But she's still dur durable. But she is more flimsy. But she wrinkles more and easily. So, she feels really nice. And because she doesn't have the squishy belly, I think it compensates for that. I don't think I should get, ever get rid of this baby. I got stuff thrown everywhere in here. That's what I do when I'm dressing the babies. I make a mess. I'm trying to get it where you guys can have a better view of Zoe. But really quickly, I'll show you guys what I'm talking about. I don't know. Well, her chest wrinkles about the same. Her arms, I don't know. They wrinkle about. Yeah, they wrinkles about the same, but she has a lot more. Um, I guess because she's lighter, she has a lot more purplish and red and bruising on her. Well, it shows more on her than him. She reminds me so, like laying right here. Oh my god, in this view, she looks so much like my son when he first came out. Like. Not the first few days, I mean literally when he first was born, that very first day, she looks so much like him. I think I better um stop being stupid talking about selling her because I don't think I'll see another baby that looks so much like my baby. And I've posted pictures on um on Facebook. I, th I don't know if I paste posted on Facebook in an open forum, but certain of my friends, I sent them picture, a picture of my son. I had to crop it, of course, so he don't show everything on him. But it shows he was so fair when he was born. But Zoe has a lot of color, though, to her, too. So it's kind of like, it's crazy because he's he's light now, but he's not that light. But um, that's typical, though, with um, ethnic babies. They are born really light a lot of times, and then they gradually get darker. That's why their ears are normally have color to them. Um, but he's only darker because he's in the sun. Girl, you're a little fat, but I don't know about this. Dang, Zoe. Or maybe mommy ain't doing something right. I feel like I got to force these little buttons on. But she does look like she's going to look good in purple. Yeah. I like her tongue because it it moves up and down in her mouth. So that's what I like about her tongue when I said in the other video that I like her tongue better. I, I never even, to be honest though, I never looked to see if I can, um, if I could move his tongue. I guess that's not really fair to say. Now her her arms, because she is softer, her arms do tend to move all over the place because 
she is softer so but I, it, I love it <laughs> I love both of them let's see all right guys that is it I gotta run so say bye bye aunties here's mama's favorite hand yes it is polka I like the way they're sculpted though because they can move their hands different ways because that's just the way they were sculpted I guess.